Uh, Will you? What are you doing? What you, what, 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 stop. We've, what are you doing? Stop. You stop. Just calm down. Calm down, sir, woman. Why are you so aggressive? What's up? Stop shaking. Calm, please. Sorry, I can't hear you. I'm not allowed to. Right. Uh, there's potential terrorist threats. There's potential terrorist threats. Here, what in here? Oh shit. Because how is the terrorist threats going on in here then? Do you want to turn the camera off? No, do you? Well, turn your camera off. No, it should be on. If you're talking to a member of the public. Now oh, it's on. Yeah, alright. Cheers. How did, no, 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 you've just said there's a terrorist threat in here. Yeah, I've got to say the potential. We've got to investigate. Yeah. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stop. You stop. Just calm down. Calm down, sir. What are you doing? Stop. Just calm down. Calm down, sir. Woman. Why are you so aggressive? What's up? Stop shaking. Calm, please. Can you call the police, please? Yeah. All right. He was calm. Why have you come all aggressive to me? I'm, I'm talking. I, hang on. We was in the middle of talking. Why have you just come? It's nothing to do with you. Why is that then? Are you the manager? I'm gonna. I'm, I'm allowed to be in here. Not with that on you. I'm not. Right. Why is that then? I'm just. I don't, can we just try and talk without shouting, please? That's not fair. It's not. It's not fair. You're making a scene. It's not fair. I've just come to this sweet store actually, because my daughter buys sweets from me, and I wanted to video timer. There's no need for this. I'm, you'll have me arrested. He's just said there's a terrorist threat in here. That's what he's just said. How do you not know this? Why would a terrorist want to do anything here? Yeah. Exactly. How do we know? Hey, so you're all right. How's it going, all right, mate? You all right? No, I'm not really. Oh, why? Yeah, I'm going to wait for police on the way. I've just come to look at the sweet store because my daughter buys from here. So is that not nothing better to do? Pardon? Well, wait for it, please. I feel I feel very intimidated now. Good. What to come to a sweet store instead of a instead of a sweet instead of a show? I've just been there. Yeah. Go and ask him. Go and ask him. The guy who just said over there. He told me. Go and ask him. What I've just said to him. You got to make yourself look like right, Wallys. Now, aren't you? Why do you want me out? What so? Put your camera on, please. Why, why, why? Alright, keep it off then. This camera's all over it. Well, why have you got it on then? What's the point of carrying it? I haven't got it on. I'm saying, why have you got it on you then? Just... If I need to put it on, I'll put it on. Why do you not need to put it on here? I don't need to, because it's always a camera. What's up with you? Are you alright? Why are you so aggressive? I'm waiting for the police, because I believe I'm allowed to film in here. Because this is accessible to the public, yeah? Or not? Well, that's too late. Well, why walk up to a man with a camera then if you don't want to be filmed? If I don't want to get, if I don't want a suntan, I won't go out when the sun's out. Do you know what I'm saying? I'd stay indoors. I want police going to be. That's it. <laughs> See, that's how, you, that's how you take it in. Thank you. Awesome. There you go, guys. Bond Street Blinds. Get yourself down here. Good prices. There we go. Show some love for the community. That's it. See? Look at that. I'm not going to film you. Well, so what deals do you do here, then? Yeah? 
Well, this is it. I got, I got quite a few views on YouTube, and I want people to see, you know, good uh, your local issue. And it must be hard, isn't it, with this COVID stuff going on? Not many business isn't t busy, is it? No. So, guys, come on, show some support. Can I get a screenshot of this outside? Yeah. That's Thank fine. you. There we go. She said it's fine. So there we go. There we go. There you go. What are you gonna say now? So, this is blinds. Um, can we get a good price? And what, what, do you have like a leaflet or anything? Oh, awesome. There we go. Give him a call. Get some good prices. What thank are you doing anyway? I'm just getting videos, that's all. There we go. So, big respect. Be careful wiping your nose, mate. So the police will turn up now. And do you think I'll be arrested? Do you want to? Do you want to gamble? Do you want to bet? What do you want to bet? Are you a gambling man? Go on. Jesus, how many more do you need? Thank you for putting your camera on, sir. Thank you. I appreciate that, mate. Thank you. Just see, I've asked him to turn his on, but he won't. No, I appreciate it. I don't know, I was just coming in and just filmed this for the advertisement for Lady Year. And I've just been to Sweet Stall to film them, uh, film the shop there, just to promote local businesses. And uh, I've been approached, the lady just come over with handed camera, going with me all grief. I did just get permission, she was happy with that, I've just filmed her, yeah. Um, I don't think I need to. Say that again, sorry. Is it? See, the problem is, yeah. No, no, you, you sound, you can say how professional you are, straight away you did what, you, what was right. Um, I'm not having a go, I'm not, you can see I'm, by my mannerisms, you can see I'm not trying to cause a fuss. Um, he said there's a terrorist threat going on in here, and the lady said no, so I'm, I'm a bit confused to what's going on there. Is there a terrorism threat? Please don't button. I've got no idea You did say that? No, hang on, sir. Sir, you said there was a terrorist, it's not bullshit, you did say that, sir. Can you stop swearing in public? It's a public order, that, as well. You're meant to be more professional than that, swearing in public. Get arrested for that, public order. Yeah, did you not know that? Pardon? Not if you're security, so if your security gives you permission to swear, does it? Stop swearing then, please. Sorry, sir, because you've been all right. I'm, sir, come on, let's talk properly, let's not have an argument, no need to swear. You just said it was bullshit, that's swearing. That's bullshit. That's swearing. You public order for that, sir. You get arrested for that language in public. Pardon? No, it's true though, isn't it? I'm, a, I'm Absolutely, so I know the rules. See, you just said it yourself. I know the rules. So because I know the rules, you've just admitted it. Why are you, why are you changing the rules? You, you just said I know the rules, correct? Right, so if you know the rules, why are you... You know the rules. Yeah. You know how to manipulate. You know how to control. Mm-hmm. We're just, we're just doing our job. Yeah, you are, sir. You're right. And, and you know what? I'm not denying you're not. You are doing your jobs. But can you show me one sign where it says you can't take photography? Thank you. I, I don't want to touch it, if that's all right. I'll just, I'll, is that all right? I don't want to touch it. Is, sorry, can you just hold it while I just read through it quickly? It's just because we're recording. Thank you, thank you. Cheers for that. See, I can, I can, can I, can I, can you are a brescia fresher. Honestly, you really are. And you know what? You, to be fair, I thought, oh God, who's this guy who's going to come over and do me in? You've come across very professional and that's how it's meant to be done, sir. Honestly, credit to the business. And what company is it, LC? We're working for a company called Baxter. Brilliant. Brilliant, mate. All right, so, um, um, the problem is, you know these leaflets, these leaflets, who has them? We have them over here in Manchester Street, um, when we had the brother Bell situation. Yeah, I'll just stand around here just because there's people there, but go on, I'm trying not to get people in it. 
before yeah. the um, COVID, we had an information sheet uh, booth down there where we had the well. Did you? So where is that at now then? Do you know uh, what I mean? With, well, it, with the COVID thing, we've got to remain it. Did you? Uh-huh. Now that makes sense. Obviously, you don't want people picking them up, chucking them down. But no. Um, but please turn up. They won't arrest me. He said there's a terrorist threat. I've never known a terrorist to come in a supermarket. Well, that, that's not like me. No, that's what I'm thinking. I know, I know. I may be wrong, but, I, I, you know, I believe I'm doing right here. And you may not believe it. If it's accessible to the public, mm-hmm. it means it's accessible to photography. And you guys have made a rule upon that letter, which doesn't state. It shouldn't... It shouldn't st- that, that's it's your policy, but there's it's no... LCP policy, but... Yeah, it's your policy, but it's not law. And he said I could be arrested for it. And police only deal with law. They don't deal with policies, do they? Do you understand what I'm saying? This, it's a civil matter, this. This is trespass, isn't it? So I, I, I'm happy enough for you to take me to court if you want, guys. And we can go to court and deal with it if you wish. But I, I don't believe you will. If anything, you'll break the law by assaulting me. So what we have here is a gentleman who's been very polite and professional and doing everything right. This guy's made a load of lies up about terrorism. This guy's in a bad mood and he hasn't told me why. So, you know. Big respect to Bond Street Blinds for showing the love to photographers and videographers. I'm not a saddo. Come on. Cheer up. The world we're living in now, it doesn't need this. Yo, we'll go and do it then. Oh, who by? Oh, that's you. She's told you to stay here. Why don't you go and crack on then with what you're doing? Of course. Well, well, yeah, I'm not purposely grabbing anyone. You can see what I'm doing. Come on. You can see I'm not grabbing anybody. I can understand that, but I well, this, yeah, well, listen, sir, I'm not taking pictures of anyone except you three. If you're stood in front of that girl, that's your fault. Stand away from me, please. No. Oh, well, that's your own fault then, isn't it? If she's in it, because you're not standing away. I'm, I'm filming you guys for my own protection. And if you're stood in front of children, then that's your fault, not mine. So you're putting the child at risk, not me. Keep up the great work, lads. No problem. Now that is how this should be respected. So this is the market hall here in Scammersdale. So there we go. Some fantastic uh, community in, uh, you know, community spirit going on in here. People supporting each other, which is nice. Phone guys who fix phones over there. Coffee pot, farm foods. Blinds, fantastic. Well, you've got a barber's there as well. Sweet store. It's all local based, this guys. Apart from security at the moment, fantastic. So one of you guys said that I'd be arrested, yeah? So why would I be arrested? You said I'd be arrested, didn't you? Well, he did then. Did you say I'd be arrested? Uh, would I be arrested for this? Uh, it's property, so you could be arrested by the police, because it's a civil matter. So how can I be arrested by police if it's civil? Well, they'll escort you off the yeah, they, yeah, so they won't arrest me. But really, they're not even allowed to lay a finger on me. But you won't take me to court. You know why you won't take me to court? Because he won't, it won't last. You know why? Because anywhere it's accessible to the public, you can take photographs. Not with the rules. Yeah, dude, with the rules. If it's accessible to the public, there's no privacy in public, sir. You understand that? There's no privacy in public. There's privacy at home. You know, at home, you can jump in a shower naked and all that, but you can't do it in public, can you? You can't do it in here, can you? If this is private, could you do it in here? Yeah, come on, it's true, isn't it? Facts are the facts. No, but sir, by, no, but well, that's that's a shame. You should know, by security guard, you should I know. I don't need to know what. Why you not? Need. You just go into the facility, mm. take videos. No, sir. Put it on YouTube. Get a bit of giggles. 
I'm glad, I'm glad you know. <laughs> I'm glad you understand. Even he's trying to hold that smile, and you can tell. Even he's doing. Listen, we don't have to end it like this. We don't. We can. We can turn this around for you right now, because I know that you know that I know the law. So I'm all right. You've said it yourself, didn't you? You said that. Yeah. Okay. You know your stuff. Come on. Let's just have a chat. I'm not saying all I'm Yeah. Yeah, but you know, where's the line? If I give you a hundred thousand pounds, would you do stuff which is not within the law for me? Why not? I bet you're not even getting that here, are you? Probably not. You're about thirty grand, tops. Oh, sir. Give us a dance. Go on. Cheer us on. <laughs> he's, he's got it. He's about to dance. He's about to dance. Listen. I'll turn your camera off and give us a dance. No one will know. No one will know. <laughs> I don't know. The world's gone by me. The world's gone by me. Pardon, sir? I know you do. I know you do. But the head office is saying that I'd be arrested for this. I don't think that would be the case. And you know what? Police should just turn up and say, look, you're going to have to... If he's not breaching the peace, which I'm not, am I? Would you say I'm breaching the peace? That's not, again, that's not for me to say because I don't... Yeah, but you understand what breaks of the pieces, don't you? I can understand, but it depends on the interpretation of the officers. No, I'm asking you. Am I causing you... Am I causing you... Am I causing you harassment, alarm or distress? Uh, you are harassing the team. Uh, harassing the team? You know what, harassing... They're stood around me. They can walk off. Yes. So how is that harassment? Yeah, but uh, that can't be harassment then, can it? Well, it can be, if you, especially if you're not armed with the control. Sorry, yeah. Go for it. Now, at the end of the day, yeah. we can't do our job. Yeah, uh, we can do your job. This is your job. Yeah, exactly. But you, you still, you ask the questions, the questions that we're not allowed to ask because of uh, non disclosure policies. Well, you could like just that. answer with that. So we can't, do, so we can't answer with that. So but no, but you can't, you, that's exactly your answer. I'm not harassing you. Harassing you would be following you around. I'm not trying to follow you. I'm not, I want to go about my day. You're stopping me, so how can I harass you when you stop me? You understand what harassment? Are you, you, you're not trying to stop me. I'm not trying to stop. You. Okay, are you trying to stop me from doing what I'm about to do? I'm about to go and walk for down there. Is that right? Yeah. So how can that be harassment then? If you're stopping me from doing what I'm doing, I'll go and ask him. Cheers. Hey guys. Right, well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Just because. Oh, it's too late, sorry. No, no, not. But no, no, no. Are you being nice to me? Why, why are you being nice to me? You've, you've shifted your tone. You're not obnoxious. You've got something you want to do. Mm. Thank you. Irrelevant of whether we agree with it or not. But I'm not obnoxious. That's going to be my headline. Thank you, mate. No, no, it's nice to hear. You can see I'm not being aggressive. You're not, you're not aggressive. If I walked over to you and you were throwing me out, oh, what are you doing? That would could yeah, trigger a reaction. It could, yeah, but that's what she did to me. Yeah, but that's why she did. She did that to me. You've just said it's aggressive. It's an aggressive move, mm. but it's, there's no necessary aggression. It's a natural reaction. Yeah, but that, that people, natural people reaction is anger. yeah. Bear in mind, you've got a bit of history. Yeah, a natural. What's my history? Come on. You've been here before. How do you know that? Because the helicopter guys were on you were filming them. Because you were talking about the fact that lots of money from charities yeah. go to back pockets. It's true though, isn't it? Yeah, it's true. I know. It's sad, isn't it? Yeah. See, so, so, so you know, did you give me a dislike on that video? Or did you not watch it? I never watched it. So it's true. What, so this is what I mean. So you know I'm talking sense. This is why you've turned around, because well, actually, it's got a point. You've got a score, yeah, I understand that. Mm. And you've got to do what you're doing. Yeah. But do you yeah, not think this is what journalists should be doing? There is no journalism anymore. No, no, there it's isn't. Box stuff, blows off, read that letter, that letter. That's it. Well, you know it's script. You know it's script. I'm not here to give you an hard time. I'm, not, I'm really not. And this is turned around, mate. People will say, you know what, what a nice guy. And people will see that. And I'm not here to make you look like a citizen. I, you know what I want? I want people to stop stopping me for doing something I'm legally allowed to do. Unfortunately, yeah. Yeah. Um, it's a 
clear breach. Strategy, yeah. It's a clear breach of our rules. Yeah. You have a camera and you video it. Um, the, the reason for that, which is why I mentioned sales, yeah, yeah. is purely for that reason. Because yeah. But you, we, we have to secure of customers and we have to make sure the property is secure. But you know you've just said you, I've been in my history. So you know I'm not a terrorist. Because you know that I'm here to do YouTube. So that was a false allegation, yeah. sir. Yeah. Come on. We still have to try and stop you from using cameras. Why is that? In that mind. It's but what about CCTV then? We've got all those. Yeah, but what about, like, in, in the, the you know, if I got a stall in here, if I got a stall in here, was I not, would I not be allowed CCTV? Do you know what I mean? Now, that's a, surely if it's my goods and my protection, then surely I'm allowed to... Well, some of the stall holders do have Well, there we go then. For so, protection. how do you not know I'm not filming for protection? I know you're filming. <laughs> You're a good guy, mate. Honestly, you are. And I'm not, you know, we're going to turn this one around. Guys, please, don't give him an hard time because he's a nice guy, actually. He's, he's got a good smile on his face and he knows I don't mean any harm. You know what it is. I'm, I am one of these people who go about and go, look, I'm legally allowed to film, so I'm going to do it. Your prerogative. Yeah. And in a month or that was a bit of smoke behind it because your YouTubers or however many you get with the uh, yeah. bit of advertising thrown in there that was some money per view. You know, so you've got business. You know the script, don't you? You know the script. Right, listen. Have the police been called? As if... far as we're aware, yeah. Now, this is a question. If you said that you didn't ring the police, I may have gone. The only reason I want to stay now is to see what the police do because they'll be breaking the law if they leave me, if they... You know, a little bit of advice. I want to give you some advice. Even though I'm all about content, this is, let me, and it's about exposing and, and highlighting um, tyrants because that's, that's the idea behind this. I'll give you a bit of an idea. If someone comes in with a camera from now on, they would be in and out. You know, if someone FaceTimes someone, like my mum right now, you'd, you'd just let them get on with it, wouldn't you? I get that, they could be filming, and people walk around with the cameras. Yeah. Uh, the, the trouble is, you've been in before, you've done it before, so there's intent there. There's intent for what? To film again. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And unfortunately, we've got to follow the rules. You know, even if the rules are not followed by the law, do you not follow the law, or do you just follow what your boss says? Because you could land yourself in a lot of trouble, you know, dragging someone out for filming. Imagine that. Well, yeah, but you said, that no, but, you know, we're see, this is what I mean. You are sound, you guys, because I've been, I've had my phone took off me, dragged off me, dragged on floor, dragged just for filming. You're not allowed to do it. And it's, you know I'm wrong. And have I stepped over your space in anyway? No, no. And, and have I stepped over your space? Uh, no. Thank no, you. No, as far as I know, you should not even said to He's been uh, very... Look, we have just been having a chat with him. We're going to turn this one around for, for the sake of YouTube and the sake of public interest. I think my message is clear that we should be allowed to film anywhere we're allowed to walk. If we can see it, we should be able to film it. And that is law, by the way. There's no privacy in public. You know that, anyway. Um, and we don't take anyway in No, 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 but even in public, like, you know, you were stood in front of that girl then... Um, I'm, as long as I wasn't focusing on that child, which I wasn't, I was talking to you, you there's no law in it. Because obviously, if you're filming in a, okay then, you're filming at a fairground and there's other children on the rides. Do you understand what I mean? There's not, you can't. Yeah, exactly. I was filming you, I wasn't filming the child. That's the difference. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I'm sitting there purposely filming children, then there's a problem. Of course there is. You've got, an, there's intent of something there, but. I was focusing on you, which is obvious. Um, and um, so, yeah, but my point is, there's no privacy in public. And like I said before to you, you can take a shower at home because that's your public, that's private, that's your own place. You couldn't physically take your clothes off here because it's private and go and have a shower in the corner because there's members of public here. Cool. But you'd be arrested for it. Yeah, yeah. Because, it's, because it's in public. And public means there's no privacy. That's what I'm trying to get at. Please just relay this to your mess manager. She was a bit aggressive. She was very aggressive coming over to me. You know, you've seen it. You've just said it was aggressive. She needs to change that attitude because she's only going to end up in a lot of trouble. She is. She might think she's doing right, but the reality is she's not. Law, the law states that I'm allowed to film in here. The law states. And when it goes to court, that's all they matter about. They don't care for anything else but law. Forget about policy. The law states, if it's in public, you're allowed to film. And that's what needs to change. Not just in here, but all places. Well, on the other hand, you also have to understand that. 
Well, it's not a big thing. Policy that yeah, but when it goes to court, they don't care for policy. They care if you brought the law or not. Does that policy cover you if something went wrong? I don't know. Like, so for instance, you dragged me out because I'm not allowed to film. Does that does that policy then cover you and protect you guys if I sue you? You're yeah, but this is it, so it doesn't cover you, does it? We've got CCTV on yeah. us. 24 7, yeah. yeah as much as mm. I know the customers. So it's for our protection, the customers. Protection. Yeah. Well, look, I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave because you start, used to have turned. This is how you meant to talk to public. Like this. You guys are doing it right. So I'm going to leave on that basis. All right? Honestly, thank you, mate. Thank you very much, sir. All right? Yeah, no, no, you don't need to escort me, please. I can walk myself. Just give me that. Big respect, guys, honestly. Much love to you guys. You don't get enough respect, you know that? No, thank you. No problem. Have a nice day, guys. Thank you. But, uh, yeah, honestly, it uh, must, must be not a nice uh, job sometimes, eh? There's good, some good days and bad days. What's good? What, tell me a good day. Rescuing somebody. Oh, out the car good point. There's plenty of good days. Yeah, true. Yeah. Getting back to normal where we can go in skills and do chats. Oh, we can go into people's that's awesome, man. Stuff like that. That's brilliant. No, guys, honestly, you don't get enough respect in the media. You don't. You, sh you guys should be on the front page, not not Kerry Katona, right? <laughs> yeah, I will. I'll keep spreading <laughs> the message. Well, well, if that's the way the media's going, we're all screwed, aren't we? Cheers, guys. Thank you. Have a great day and keep up the fantastic work. We're going to turn this one around. At first, it was a bit heated. But look, this just shows. I'm not here to cause trouble. I've got to really continue to push on it and push on it and push on it. But you're nice to me. I talk nice to you, regardless of what you've just done. This is Concourse Shopping Centre in Scamersdale. Last time we was here, we exposed two individuals who was taking money from people, which, like the security guard said was wrong and they shouldn't have done it so uh yeah okay i'm gonna give that an eight out of ten yeah i am big respect guys don't forget to subscribe like and i'll see you all on the next one see you later